Hey, thank you for joining my channel again. This is gonna be a really quick little sort of install, little DIY install. Uh, excuse my voice, uh, I had a cold, like a sinus infection last week. Still haven't got over the, the voice part of it yet and the, the endless coughing at night, which my wife loves when we're going to bed. Anyways, this video is super quick. As you can see, I'm sort of like in a different shot, different area here. This is just my bikes hanging up on the wall. This is how I hang all my, my bikes up here, the family bikes. And I just thought, you know what? Is there a better way than just the regular hook that you buy at Home Depot or Lowe's? Um, I don't have the YouTube money <laughs> to buy those amazing, super like awesome hooks that move and turn and do all that crazy stuff that you see with a lot of these other mountain bike YouTube guys up there. And you know, that's awesome. That's awesome that they can do that. I can't. So I thought, what's better than a black hook? And I'm like, there's a store up here in Canada, because I live in Canada now. There's a store up here called Decathlon. And they have these things, these are dirt cheap. These are like super cheap. So I thought, you know what? Let's just try these, see if these are better than that, that hook, the hook that goes right around. Let's just see if this holds the bike tire and wheel better. Easier access or something, and it's freezing outside, and I can't really mountain bike. So I thought, you know what? Let's just throw these on and, and see if it works. So without further ado, let's, uh, let's get these up, see how it works, and then uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do that. Because uh, I'm leaving for like Alberta on Monday, and today's Saturday. So maybe I'll do some videos from there, maybe I can rent a bike out there, but it is October. I'll be there October 28th, I'll be in Alberta, BC, and I'm going down to Montana. Just check it all out. But uh, God, I want to ride, there's so many good trails. But it might be freezing, there might be snow, and I'm not bringing my bike, I'm bringing my wife and kids. But maybe I can rent one, we'll see. Anyways, back to this awesome video of hooks. <laughs> Thank you very much, thanks for watching. All right, so let's just start by taking out the old hook here from where the bike was. All right. <laughs> Get this done here. All right. Just depackage these guys super quick. Cutters. All right, let's measure my purse. So I had the hook going like this, so I mean we could have to move it over a bit, but there you go. All right, get some screws, get it done. All right, let's use one of these screws, just a long wood screw. We'll see if this works good. Using my trusty Makita drill I've had forever. All right, so we'll put it pretty close to where it came out. This is gonna be rough. It's the two by four is like right there. I don't wanna split it. There we go. All right, and then we'll just put a second one in here. Okay, that's not going anywhere. All right. Moment of truth, let's put the bike up and see. Okay, so here's the moment of truth. Let's put the bike on, let's see how, let's see how she goes on. Ooh, that's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. All right, so here's the bike hanging up. It is way tighter, way tighter. Yeah, that, that, I know it's a big tire, but I mean, that fits in much better than, uh, than my black hooks. Like look, how much room, like, look how much room there is here. As opposed to, as opposed to there. All right, let's throw the other bikes up. <clears throat> we'll see how that works, but that looks pretty darn good. If I do say so myself. All right, all the bikes are on now. Looking pretty good, like, tires are pretty straight. Like, it actually keeps the tires bang on. Like, here we go. That's pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. My daughter's pretty on a good too. Look at that. I'm pretty happy. I mean, these were like 10 bucks, I think. 
<clears throat> 10 bucks each. I think I'm on, I think they're on sale, maybe even seven bucks. I'm not sure. But looking pretty darn good. Okay, so it's all hung up. My DIY project for Saturday afternoon is done. I got rid of these old school like black hooks and I replaced some of these decathlon uh, blue guys. But what I like about this is, let's see if I can get my ugly head out of the way so you can see what I'm doing here. Okay, there we go. So there's like, uh, I don't know if you can see, there we go. Uh, you can see like how much difference there is. See how much of a gap there is? So when you're hanging that bike, you've got like, I would say almost like half an inch to an inch of difference. So it's actually, this is closer to the wall than this guy. So what's nice about that is the bike will stay closer to the wall. If you bang with your shoulder or your leg and you're moving the bikes around, they're not gonna move around. It's just nice and easy, it goes to the wall nice and simple. It's super, super easy, just drill them in, done. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, and comment. Um, yeah, I know my, my videos suck, but please keep commenting, keep liking, keep subscribing. I really appreciate it. I'm almost at a thousand. I'm so close. I'm so close. Anyways, <coughs> excuse me. My voice sucks. I know. Um, I'm off to Alberta. I've never been to Alberta before, so I'm off to Alberta this Monday. So, like, Two days away, I can't wait to check it out. I hope I can go out riding there. And uh, hey, if you see me out there, say hi. Thanks so much, have yourself a great day.